What's going on everyone, x is Shotix here from NTP and I'm back again with another Hermitcraft member today. We have Pudgeons. Uh, yes, this is the end of the second row, so isn't that exciting? That's probably the most exciting thing for me because that means I'm halfway down. It's all downhill from here, guys. All down We've been uphill, like climbing. This is the halfway point. It's all downhill. We just have these last two rows and then Hermitcraft is bye bye <laughs> It is done and that's probably the most exciting part is that it will be done so yep all right but yeah, this is pungence link to his channel will be in the middle will be in the description um, as well as a link to the video in which we made all these and you know in one big old time lapse it was really exciting so if you haven't seen it check it out uh, I made it a very long time ago so yeah it's pretty it's a pretty cool thing to check out that we made a long time ago if you haven't seen it so go ahead check it out love it you know but um Let's go get into this like a Dragon Ball skin, so I think it's pretty cool. But dimension time, legs here are eight by four by twelve. The torso here is eight by four by twelve, and the arms are attached or aligned to the torso, and they are four by four by twelve. And the head here is eight by eight by eight, with no head effect at all on any side, so there you go. Uh very nice. Pretty cool, pretty exciting, so there you go. Um, and those dimensions are linked by width by height, and will be in the description, as well as pictures at the very end in the plastic texture pack. Um, so make sure you check that out. Um, I'm just double checking something here. And, yes. So, alright guys. Let's go ahead and get into this now. So, um, detail time, front of the legs. Sorry, I just had to double check something. I was double checking, oh, I'll just say it, cause I probably have to retake this. I think I missed the back of him. Um, I'll explain this now. The front and the back are pretty much exactly the same. So, like, you can see the very front of his body is exactly the same as the back. Like, the detail and everything is exactly the same. And I'm not even kidding, like, everything is exactly the same. Except, like, this right here on the front. Like, just this part and just this back are like right here these are the only differences otherwise it's all exactly the same which is insane but um yeah so uh i, I don't like the thought of having to go back and take a picture of that and if i don't have to i'd rather not but you never really know so i guess we'll find out but anyway uh, <laughs> yeah, anyway, here, here's uh, the front of the legs. So, blue, cyan, light blue for the shoes. And then, of course, we detailed it with orange and pumpkin. Um, such a long, long time ago. It may actually be jack o -lantern. I'm pretty sure it's jack o -lantern. Maybe. If not, then it's just plain pumpkin. But, uh, pumpkin, orange, yellow. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And, uh, another brick. So, there you go. Come around here to this side. All these colors just wrap around. Pumpkin, uh, light blue blue, orange, and yellow. All those just wrap around, so check that out. Ain't that cool. And the back here is uh, pretty much the exact same as the front. So you just have to mirror it. Not even kidding. Just mirror the pants. Mirror the feet. Everything. Just mirror that right across. Very, very easy. And then uh, fix that right there. Or not fix it, but <laughs> I'm saying fix it because I'm looking at that hand and I need to fix it. But um, then just, you know, bring those colors across and stripe it and there you go I don't know how this happened I, I have did someone decide he needed to have fingers or something or I have no idea guys what happened right here so let's just go ahead and fix that right let's let's just fix that so uh, let's do this so where, where's our there we go all right there we go now he's got a whole hand again so all right cool so here's the front of him now front of his body Oh, going blinks as you just saw there. Uh, yellow, pumpkins, orange, um, and another brick kind of for the uh, shirt part. And then for the other parts, like uh, the blue parts, it's uh, blue, cyan, light blue, and then lapis lazuli. It's kind of wicked. And it's kind of all over the place, but you can see it. You can definitely see it. So there you go. And because we're kind of squeezed here, can't really see much. The, the colors all just kind of wrap across, though. Oakwood planks to the blue, you know, right here between the two lapis lazulis, and it's just 
Oakland planks all the way up to the top, to the very top here, where you just have the blue. So, um, and here's the back. I'm not going to take a picture of the back. I'm taking that back. I'm not going to do it, because this is going to take way too long for me to come back in here. I'm sorry, guys, but um, this is going to be the part where you get the back of him, all right? So, this will be the part where you get the very back of him. So, I will take my sweet time. So, here's the back of this arm, all right? Back of this arm, it's actually, I think, an exact copy of the front, but wait, if it's not, it's not, who cares? So, Oakland planks, blue, lapis lazuli, Oakland planks, all the way up to the shoulders, where, you know, you can see there's orange, pumpkin, blue, lapis lazuli there, and then blue and light blue. So, there you go. Obviously, this arm is exactly the same, but I'll go ahead and show you that as well, from, like, this weird angle. I know, I'm sorry, but there's this arm. You can see it. It's amazing. It's freaking gorgeous. Love that arm. Alright, so here's the back of the... So here is his back. You have yellow, pumpkin, or I guess jack-o'-lantern if you want to make him glow. Because um, he's like, you know, a, a Dragon Ball Z character. He could totally glow and, like, you know, own it. Um, orange, pumpkin, yellow. And he's got the blue, the light blue, the cyan, the lapis lazuli, and then the nether brick. And then, of course, the uh, oak planks at the very top. So here's this still a shot for, like, a picture. And then... Just because I'm just going to slowly go up, you know, here's all the way up to this. We'll move up again to this half, right above, like, it's like under the blue line. Like right here is under the blue line, and then you have above the blue line. <laughs> so there you go. So, and then here's that. Alright, so there's the back. Alright, remember there's not going to be a picture of that, so, in, in the end, just, just a warning. But alright, so here is uh, this. And, uh, or this, in front of his face. Oakwood planks, oakwood, black, white, brown. Those are the materials for this. Seeing that, good. Alright, moving on. Coming over here, just brown and oakwood planks. There you go. That's it. That's all you need. And you have this side of the head. Hang on, doing something? Alright. Alright, so now the back of his head is like a standard back of a Steve head where you just have, you know, the Oakland planks they connect and it's just brown all the way around. So check that out, that's really easy. I'm sorry, I got really, really simple. And then I'm pretty sure this side of the head is the exact same as the other side. It is, so just mirror this right across with the Oakland planks and the brown. And you have that. A lot of mirroring on this guy. And then just fill the top with brown. And then you are done with pungents. It took a little bit longer than I kind of wanted it, wanted it to, but, you know, it kind of happens. But alright, that's it for him. If you guys have any requests, leave them in the comments. It could be other YouTubers or skins or whatever, custom stuff. It doesn't matter. We'll, we pretty much just do it all. So uh, just let us know. We'll make it. So <laughs> thank you guys for watching. As always, I will see you for the next one.